say is the biggest challenge you've had in the city council in trying to vanguard women's issues? Um, I think the, the biggest challenge for me is the fact that helping other people understand that women's issues are very much, are very important, just as important when we're talking about, you know, for example, we were just talking about legislation on this alternate side and council member Don is saying you can park and double park on one side of the street. Um, but then we're talking about these um, pregnancy centers that I just had a hearing about that uh, are not giving women accurate information and they open up next to these abort, um, you know, abortion clinics or clinics that are there to help ha provide opportunities for women. And in me having this conversation, and he's like, well, you know, can you come to my hearing? I said, oh, you missed mine. <laughs> so being able to, to motivate and get other members to come and actually sit in our hearings, because when I've invited others to sit, they're like, wow, that was such a good hearing, Jennifer. I never thought of that. And that actually happened also with um, the alternative, alternative forms of birthing. Um, our, our, there's an incredible increase in C-sections for women in the city. And it all, it seems that after the hearing we found out it has to do a lot with malpractice. Right. So, but it had to come up and then we, they learned about doulas and, and, and I, I don't have children yet, but all these council members that were not part of the committee, I guess it had spread out in the hall and they came to share. So C-section, not C-section, midwives, doulas, and I think that when people actually sit and listen to our topics, they find the connection. But it's really trying to find the human connection where sometimes women's issues aren't necessarily always upfront about policy. They're not always upfront of this is the law. It, it, you, you tend to have to hear the um, or be part of the hearing, and then of the hearing, there's legislation that comes out of it. So it's kind of a, the other way around where if you're sitting in consumer affairs, it's a law that we're listening to and then it, you know, that's the complexity sometimes of our issues.